Hello? I wish I was a little bit taller. I wish I was a baller. I wish I had a girl who looked good. I would call her. I wish I had a rabbit in a hat with a bat. A six form. disease along with my excitement about cause genetic disease along with my excitement about so Ricky Mendoza shot me a question asking if I could share any avid tips I'm using avid every day from 9 to 5 30 I've been doing so for quite a while for those of you not interested in editing or anything like that feel free to just to tap through these and ignore them so my tip for the day actually has to do with a customization on the Avid keyboard. The H used to actually be splice, which was like the old razor blades on analog editors. Then they made it into this. So this, uh, where the splice used to be, they actually turned into something called focus, which actually like zooms in and out on your timeline, which is kind of useful, but I don't use it. So under your settings panel, if you go to the keyboard setting here and actually choose your, uh, your keyboard, you can double click that and customize your keyboard. That brings up this nifty little graphic interface where you can see the current mapping of your keyboard. Um, I have mine customized right now so you can see the way I'm going to show you how to do it. The next thing you're going to want to do is go up to your tools menu at the top and select command palette. I'm on a Mac but this will look similar on Windows. That pulls up an interface like this. Has all your commands. Inside the command palette You'll see these little buttons along the bottom, the little radio buttons. Select the one that says button to button reassignment. At the top of the command palette, you have these little tabs. Select the one that says edit. And at the bottom, you'll see this one that says add edit. That's the splice feature I was telling you about. The button to button reassignment selected, you're going to click on add edit, you're going to drag it up here onto the H and let go. And now the focus has become the splice. The reason I like for the splice to be right there on the H is because most of your activity is happening on the JKL buttons. So having the splice right there, easy access to your index finger is key for me. Your keyboard's mapped. All you have to do is position your playhead where you want it. Press the H key and it makes your cut. Of a protein that functions. All right, so I hope you found that useful. I'll be doing these occasionally. If you're interested, if you're not interested, don't worry. Most of my snaps are about things that are completely different. All right, so how about all of you guys? What do you do? What are you passionate about? What are you working on? What are you thinking about working on? What have you been talking about working on? What is it? been a long day. I'm going to go drive home now in my car that is not a Tesla.
bedtime. Going to a conference tomorrow at the LA Coliseum. Never been there before, but I'm pretty excited about it. And I think it's going to be pretty awesome. Thank you for being